Welcome to the Citadel Members homepage. It offers easy access to all the services that you might need, so let's take a brief tour. The three tabs up at the top here, your account, your documents and create a document are always available. We'll come back and look at each in more detail. Here's a search option, your current details and quick links to your recent documents. On the right are more links to popular features. You can also view previous invoices by clicking here. You'll also find these options under the tabs back at the top, so let's take a look at each tab in turn. Your account. Your account page is where all your details are stored, from company addresses to the people responsible for health and safety. The information here is applied to all your documents, so be sure to fill out your account page as a first step. Your documents. Here, on your documents page, you'll find an archive of the last 30 risk assessments and method statements that you've created with Citadel. They're listed in date order. Just click on where it says view your document. Create a document, risk assessment. Selecting the create a document tab gives you access to a set of toolkits down the left here that cover every aspect of health and safety. Let's walk through a risk assessment to see how they work. To start, open the risk assessment toolkit. That makes available all the documents in this category with a description of each here on the right. Let's say that you want to create one that's site-specific. Selecting Site-Specific Risk Assessment launches a tool that will create the document in three simple steps. The first just requires some general information, like the name and address of the project. If you've used this tool before, details from your last visit will be saved like we have here. Step two is to select any hazards that may apply. We just work through the list. Let's say that hand tools will be used in this example and check the box. We then wait for a small pop-up window. The tool now asks about controls that are required for the use of hand tools and we select the ones that apply. I'm going to just check two, one for existing controls and one specifically for this job. Next, I'll skip down to the bottom where we're asked about the level of risk. Initial risk is set to medium by default and residual risk to low. Let's leave those as they are and move on. OK. We're back to working through the hazards. The next one I'm going to select is exposure to excessive noise. Just as before, a pop-up appears within the tool to guide us through the controls that might be required. Let's check a couple. Skip to the bottom, change the initial risk this time, and we're back to working through the hazards again. It's the same every time. Once we've worked through all the hazards, and let's say we have, I can move through to step 3 of the risk assessment tool. Here, I'm going to enter any further action that's required, the review date, and hit create the document. It's done. Simple as that. Create a document, health and safety policy. To finish off, I'm going to show you one more quick example of how to create a document, this time a health and safety policy. We select the create a document tab, then health and safety policies from the list of toolkits here on the left. From the documents in this category, I'm going to select fire safety and it's there straight away, complete with company details from your account page. Conclusion. The Citadel service has been developed with the help of feedback from its customers. So, if you have any thoughts on our service, we'd be pleased to hear them. In the meantime, enjoy using the site.